start recording. Stop the cap. Stop the cap. What's up, guys? How y'all doing? As you can see, I'm playing a new Pokemon game. Because everybody else, everybody else seems to be playing Pokemon that I know. Everybody else is playing Pokemon. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to play Pokemon too. I want to see. I want to see how I do in the game. So that's what I'm going to do. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's start off. Let's play. Go. Oh, crap. What should I play? Should I play Nuzlocke? Let's see how I do. The Nuzlocke challenge adds a lot to the difficulty of the game. Fainted Pokemon uh -huh, are considered dead, and you are able to catch only one Pokemon per route. Some optional rules can be toggled on your option menu. Okay. Are you sure you want to play? Of course. Of course. You not see who I am? <clears throat> Let's see. Who is it? Oh, hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. Oh, snap. My dude swagging with, some, with his sandals. My name is Bam, Bamboo. Oh. Er, but if you find that hard to pronounce, you can just call me the Pokemon Professor. You're the kid who's applying for a job, right? Great. Want to slow down? On uh, what you want to load down, what you'll be doing. Uh, nope, nope. I think I'm good. I think I know how to play Pokemon. What's up? What's up, little bird, squirrel? You humans share the world with creatures known as Pokemon. More than mere animals, Pokemon possess astonishing powers and remarkable intelligence. People and Pokemon coexist in many ways. Some people are kept. Some Pokemon are kept as pets. Others help us with work, and and still others are used to battle trainers such as yourself. Pokemon, Pokemon Master. There's so much we still don't know about Pokemon. That's my job. I study Pokemon for a living. Specifically, I am an expert on Pokemon elements. Every Pokemon has an elemental type, and each type has its own strengths and weaknesses. But why do they exist? Are there are there new types we haven't discovered yet? Uh, but I tell you more at your first day on the job. <laughs> Report to my lab tomorrow to get your first Pokemon. Now you have to fill the form here. All right, this is where we get started. Who should I be? Should I be a male, female, or non-binary? I mean, my dude got a lot of hair right here. He kind of looks like, kind of looks like me. You know what I mean? He got, he, I got the hair. So I think I'll pick, I'll pick this guy. Let's see, what, what should his name be? Uh, something, something non-binary. <laughs> Let's see. Well, well, Alex. That's also my name. Yes. Yes. Your journey, your story is about to unfold. The future is blank slate. You, you, together with your Pokemon, are going to fill it. So it will be a challenge and a, and thrills, and your bond to make exciting discoveries. Let's go. Let's go. Ten years ago, Alex's family lived in Beach, Beale Beach City, the largest city in Tondor. Their father, Kellen, Kellen, was a brave and talented Pokemon Ranger. Oh, he was a Ranger. Their mother, Lucille, was a brilliant scientist and an expert on nuclear energy. Nuclear, huh? Although they both worked demanding jobs, they always found time to spend at home with young Alex. Oh, they were good parents. 
The Tando region was at peace and Lucille company was working on a form of clear energy that would change the world. The future seemed bright until, there's always an until, always. They can't just be like, you know. It was an ordinary day at the nuclear power plant where Lucille worked. As part of the routine inspection, they brought in a specialist to take a look at the electrical system. Uh huh. Cameron, have you finished your diagnostics? Because I have everything seems to be per working perfectly. This generator you designed really does its job well, Lucille. Excellent. If everybody has finished their work, we will break for lunch. A uh, boss, you might want to take a look at this. Hmm. Strange. The temperature reading are far higher than normal. Either we need to reset the thermometer or the reactor is leaking massive amount of heat. Oh no. That's not good. It can't be the thermometer. It's just checked it. So. Oh my god. That was loud. Uh oh. See the breach in the reactor. This temperature is just a few minutes. We'll have to total meltdown. Everybody needs to evacuate now. Oh god. Mama, get out of there. You still you have to leave too. No, mama! Mama, no! With Cameron's help, all the scientists were able to escape unscathed. Except Lucille. She was never seen. Oh, crap! Radiation leaked from the broken reactor, making, making the surrounding areas uninhabitable for, ye for many years. The foiling any foiling any attempt to try and search for her. Also, his wife had profound effects on Catelyn. His personality changed. He became cold and dedicated to his job. In time, he got promoted to Chief of Tandor Pokemon Rangers. However, he became too busy to care for his child. Oh my god! She and Alex was sent to live with their elderly auntie. In Moki Town. Moki Town! Moki! If you like Moki, put in the comments. Auntie's health waned. Supporting the child was too much work for her. For her. Dang, did she die too? Fortunately, Ernest Bamboo, the local Pokemon person, was looking for a research assistant. Two kids from Moki Town apply Alex and their childhood friend DL. It was common for youth of certain age to receive a Pokemon and travel the region. As a Pokemon trainer. And so Alex journey, journey, journey began. Journey began. Alright, finally. Alex, come downstairs. You're late. Ooh. What we got here? Is a Nintendo Wii? New system coming out. That Switch, though. Uh -huh. Okay. Sick. Uh, let me um, do something real quick. Oh, my God. The volume is kind of loud. Turn down the sound effects. Turn down the music just a tad. Here we go. That's a little better, right? Right? That's a little better? I hope so. I hope it's a little better. Whoa, look at that house, bruh. Auntie got a bed downstairs. We got a TV hung up on the wall that don't big. What's that, 60 inch? What's up, Auntie? Should I do voices? Alex, sweetie, today is your big day, isn't it? And this is my voice? No, this is her voice. I can't help but feel glum seeing my little one all grown up and leaving home. Oh, if only those these old bones could do more so that I could support us both. Don't worry about it, Auntie. You helped me out. You did you did you did good. But we both know that you're ready for this. You and that boy Theo. Oh, such a sweet boy. Such simple thighs. Uh, always following in your footsteps. That one. Wow. Such a such a body. 
You've always been so capable. But I wonder about him. He is younger after all. I'm sure his father, Cameron, wouldn't allow him to go unless he was sure. Anyway, to celebrate your big day, I got you a present. Go ahead, open it. Ooh, what I get? Oh, she got me them new kicks, bruh! It's a run, hold Z. Okay. Got it. <laughs> oh, don't mind me, sweetie. I'm just an emotional old lady. If only your father were here right now. Well, I'm sure he's proud of you, too. And I am positive. You'll run into him during your adventure. Now, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Say hi to that nice professor man for me. Will you? If you don't mind stopping by again after you get your first Pokemon, I'd love to see it. Good luck, sweetie. Aw, Auntie, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. Uh, what's that? I got my running shoes. Got my running shoes. Look at that. Damn, I'm so fast. Now you know. They always got that potion. And you know you always gotta grab it. Ooh. Moki Town. Moki Town. I like it. Oh god, what is why is that running water? Okay. Let's see. Where am I going? Where am I going? That's my house. Uh, what the freak? Who was that? Come here. Oh, God. What are you? What are you? No, come here. I want to see where you are. <laughs> chin chin. Uh, uh, where? Yeah, I know, I know I can't go out that way. God dang it. Trying to find the Pokemon Laboratory. Oh, can't go that way. <sighs> Must be up. Is that up? Nope. Wait, is it? Hey, wait up. Who said that? Who said that? Ooh, what's up, bruh? <laughs> Where do you think you're going, huh? Are you trying to get to the lab before me? So you can get better Pokemon? Well, that ain't gonna happen. Because I'm gonna get the strongest one first. Try to keep up, Alex. Bro, why is why is always your rival trying to be fast? Every time. Every time. So let's see. Should I give him a voice too? I'm gonna give him, gonna give him a sexy voice. Hey. If it isn't Alex. And uh, your friend. Tommy, wasn't it? Honestly, Pops, can't you even remember my name? It's Theo! Theo! Right, right, Theo. You're just in time. Today is a very special day for both of you. It's your first day as w at work as a field research assistant at Bamboo Pokemon Research Lab. Your job will have you traveling across Tendor, observing and capturing my diff many different kinds of Pokemon that help me with my research on Pokemon elements. I have three Pokemon here that will aid you in your journey. Before you get your before you get your started, though, you will both have to will both take the Pokemon Trainer Aptitude Test. Test? I didn't study for no test. I thought you were gonna just give us a rare Pokemon, powerful Pokemon. Now, now, don't worry. It's not the kind of test that you have to study for. It's just a way to determine that kind of Pokemon trainer you will be. Different starter Pokemon are better suited for different battling styles. A starter Pokemon will be your lifelong partner. So it's important for you to work well together. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Enough talk. I want to get my Pokemon. Sheesh, kid. You're not, even, you're not very patient, are you? Alright, if you want to know more about what's the test before we begin, you can talk to my aide. Now, Alex, are you ready to take the trainer's aptitude test? 
Of course. Of course. Excellent. So without further ado, when you encounter a new poke a new kind of Pokemon in the wild, what is your first reaction? Uh huh. Oh, I get it. I get it. You're not actually choosing your Pokemon. You're it's it's like Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Okay. Let's see. What would I do? I see a Pokemon. I'm going through the I'm going through I'm going through the bushes. I'm like this. I'm like this. All of a sudden I see it. I see what the freak. I look, I'm looking. Just watch it. See what it does. Got it. Easy. Very good, both of you. Come on, that was easy. Give me a tougher one. Okay, next question then. Which of these TMs would you prefer to teach your Pokemon? Uh. Hmm. Hyper Beam is all power. Protect is defense. Hidden power is depending on. Hidden power depends on like some some hidden some hidden mechanic. It's like a hidden mechanic for hidden power. Uh. All right, I know what to do. I think I think I just use protect. Cause you're not hitting me either way. Hey, professor. What's a TM anyway? You know what TM is, bruh? What the freak is wrong with you? And you wanna be a Pokemon Meester? Um, I'm uh I'll tell you later. Let's move on with the next question, shall we? Which of the following Pokemon would win in an all out battle? Gyarados, Gliscor, Ampharos. All out battle, huh? I would say, I, hmm. Gliscor, Ampharos can't hit Gliscor because he's part ground, but Ampharos can hit Gyarados. Gyarados can hit Gliscor, but it's not effective. To Ampharos, cause he's. Hmm. The Glass will use Earthquake. Oh, I don't know. God dang it! I'm picking random. Ampharos. Is it possible to fail a test? No, it isn't. Now, this is your final question. So, answer honestly. What is your motive for becoming a Pokemon trainer? Uh, I don't care about making friends. Now, if it was a honey, you know what I'm saying? If it was a girl, just say it was. I would love to see a girl. Hmm. Coming the very best, yes, yeah, given though. It's more in the region. I don't really care about the region. So it's either the top one or the bottom one. Unless exploring the region means getting Pokemon. I don't know. I think I think I'll I'll I think I'll pick the middle one. There we go. No question about it. I mean, I mean, no question about it. I'm gonna be a Pokemon master, and nobody's gonna stand in my way. Huh? 
I dig your spirit, kid. Well, that's it for the training after two tests. Now it's time to analyze your results. Okay, I finished my anal analysis. Analysis. Here we go. We get to pick a Pokemon. Alex, you seem to be a trainer who likes to play it safe. Patient and patient and endurance are your biggest assets. You know that the best thing in life comes to those who wait. For a defensive trainer like you, or Orchinix is the best pick. Oh, I thought it crashed. I was about to say. Go ahead, take the Pokemon. Ooh. Let's name it. Let's name it. What should we name it? What should we? Uh, what should we name it? Stop looking at my titties. Perv. Hmm. I'm gonna call it Mean Bean. Mean Bean. I'm talking about. Hey, I'm tired of waiting. I just got their start already. When do I get mine? I'm done analyzing your result, Theo. Hmm. What's he getting? What's he getting? Theo? Well, you certainly know what you, what you want out of life. You're impulsive, impatient, and care mostly about your own desires. But I said something else in you. Could it, could it be the seed of greatness? The potential to transform yourself completely? Or maybe it's just that you're so young I can't tell. Regardless, for a trainer like you, Electux is the best pick. Electux. Oh, Lark Talks! The freak is that? Yes, my first Pokemon! Yeah, you just gonna shut me out the way, bro? Alex, you have a Pokemon. And now I have a Pokemon, too! You know what that means, right? We have to battle! Oh, please, not in the lab. Ooh. I don't know why there's no music. I don't know why. I have to see if I can fix it. Oh, first Pokemon battle. Ooh. Bean Bean. Bean Bean is out here. All right, let's see. Scratch and growl. That's in with that growl. I mean, that scratch. How the f Yo, how how you get water gun already? Do I have another move? Huh? 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 Hold up. Yo, my... Yo, he's grass and steel? Yo, that's sick. Yo, what? Did they give me... They gave me a, a neutral nature? Oh. 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 All right. Whatever. Hit him. Hit him. Hit him. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yep.
Yes, it's my first win. My Pokemon are already gonna be the best coolest team ever, Alex. You're nothing compared to me. Okay. Uh, I gotta show Dad. Yeah. Yeah, I yeah, yeah, I bet. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, stop talking to me. Stop talking to me. I'm done. I'm done talking to you. I'm done talking to you. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm done talking to you. I'm out of here. Yeah, I don't care. Yeah, I don't care. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this this video. I can't believe I lost. I can't believe I lost. My first loss. You know what that means, right? That means my Pokemon is dead. I have to switch him out. I have to find another Pokemon and switch him out. Alright, hope you enjoyed this video. Like and like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell notifications if you want to see more. Uh dang. Just I'm drained right now. Alright, peace.